Hanging off of them. Sick my stomach. Curiosity is for doing this. Not the graves. See anything you like? Sure you do. I brought you the Lancehorn lens, Sona. I'll make a weapon with this myself. No warrior should forget the feel of craft. And you brought the signal arrows to warn? I did. Kind of hope he never has to use them, though. We stand agreed. It is a poor war chief who has a craving for war. For now, all I ask of our braves is that they are ready. I thank you for your aid.
be the pass the tour was talking about. It's Banuk territory just above. this. They're inside too. <laughs> Must have been where the soldiers slept. It's like the lodge in Mother's Heart, I guess. Or it was this place. The furnishings were... Metal. How'd they ever get comfortable? It was the metal world. Guess they were used to it. of what? Our world. The planet Earth, Aloy. It's not flat like you thought. Why would I think that? During eclipses, the shadow cast on the moon is curved. So our world is a globe. And it looks like this, from a distance. We'll discuss this another time. Back to the matter at hand. The Faro robots were spreading across the world, eating everything up. Somehow... Elizabeth stopped them before it was too late. But how?
I'd have to leave something else behind.
might have to ditch something. Dr. Sobek, you can take a seat. What? You're going to sack her after what she just said? Dr. Sobek has made the situation very clear, General, and given us an option. We should all be thanking her. No, it's just... I mean, my God! Maybe take this discussion offline. There's not going to be any discussion. You saw the numbers. Now, Pharaoh, he'll foot the bill, but his money can't buy the time necessary to complete Zero Dawn. That... That can only be paid for in blood. Oh, come on! If we upgrade our fleet, crack the code somehow... Uh... Were you not listening? Robots can't do the fighting fleet this time. When it comes to hacking, this rogue swarm is an apex predator. Anything automated you throw at it, they will hijack and take over. But this... We'd be throwing civilians into a meat grinder. Commanders, the enemy we're facing self-replicates faster than we can kill it. And it eats biomass as fuel. Zero Dawn is all we've got. So we put a railgun in the hand of every civilian strong enough to carry one, show them where the trigger is, and point them to the front? How the hell do we sell that? By giving them something to fight for. Zero Dawn. The top secret super weapons program that will save us. So long as humanity holds off the swarm long enough for Dr. Sobek and her team to finish it. The file I'm sending contains the war plan for Operation Enduring Victory. War plan? This is a war crime. It may be ugly, but it's something. Consider the alternative. Dr. Sobek. I've secured use of a decommissioned orbital launch base outside Bryce, Utah as the Zero Dawn staging area. Plenty of space there. When can you get started? I've already mailed you a list of Alpha and Beta candidates. Most are foreign nationals or subjects of corporate holdings, so extracting them... Leave that to me. You'll get your dream team. Count on it. Then I'll be off. Orbital launch base. What is that? What did these people do? What did Elizabeth do? <sighs> Glad to be rid of that place. Now I just need to find the orbital launch base they talked about. I've checked my data and located the base. That's the good news. <sighs> and the bad? It's directly underneath the Citadel. The palace at Sunfall. <sighs> the capital of the Shadow Karja. Not exactly convenient. The palace is crawling with Eclipse agents. Many in positions of authority, all of them wearing focuses. The moment they see you, Hades will too. He'll issue another kill order, and this time, the entire Shadow Karja military will be after you. So, disable their focuses. You've done it before. It's not that simple. Too many focuses in one place, each of them communicating with each other and back to Hades, a whole network of them. Network? What's that? Uh, imagine a vast, invisible web stretched across the land from end to end, connecting focuses together, allowing them to communicate over vast distances instantaneously. All right, so is there some way to cut the web down? Hmm. Crash the network. Audacious. Yes. There is a way. A weak point in the network. Point the way. <laughs> I'll send the location data to your focus. Head there, and I'll be in touch when you're close with more directions. Oh, Zero Dawn, what sort of super weapon did Elizabeth make? She stopped the machines, but not... She knew her civilization ended. 
Let's hope it won't come to that again. <sighs> now, how am I gonna get down from here? Oh, this should be quite the ride. Grapes.
crazy Osram tried to kill our Sun King. Good for an old remedy.
hunting me. Sharp and moving in the land. You're not ordinary.
close now. I was wondering when you'd speak up. There's a sheer rock wall just ahead. Look close and you'll find handholds leading up. Oh really? And who put those there? more exciting to keep it all a mystery. Crash the Eclipse Focus Network, he said. So how are we gonna do that? Oh, wait. I forgot. We won't. I do all the dangerous stuff. You just listen. There are the handholds. Right where you said they'd be. Did you get that silence? No? Fitting name you got there. Ah. All right, what now? You wait, that's what. Take a seat at the campfire and rest. When night falls, we'll talk. At least I'll have a fire to keep me company. How nice of you to finally drop by. Our purpose this night is to crash the focus network. Yeah, tell me the part I don't know. How? For starters, you'll need to infiltrate the Eclipse's main base. Wait, what? That's right. Fortunately for you, I brought you around to the back way. It's right through that crevice. Once you reach the base, you'll see the objective. A derelict tall neck that's been extensively... modified. Climb the tall neck. Grafted into the top of its disk, you'll find a module of sorts. Destroy that, and the focus network will crash. So you were part of the Eclipse? I've never been part of anything. I serve my own interests always. But it is the case that I assisted the Eclipse before I sensed the threat they might become. It was a mistake that I'm doing what I can to correct. What sort of assistance did you give them? Head through that crevice, Aloy. You have more important things to do than ask questions. <clears throat> Let's see what's through here. Collected machines. More like soldiers. Held in reserve for war yet to come. You'll have to get past them. The back way. I didn't say it'd be easy.
Explosions in the distance. Pay that no mind. Doesn't concern you. now. Head for that ridge. The tall neck's just over this ridge. You'll see it when you reach the top. Now be ready to act fast. You need to get in and get it done before they raise an alarm. Here we go. You getting this? I see the legs of a tall neck down there, but no tall neck. Damn. The transmit has been moved. Check down the ravine to the left. Only place it could be. So much for your insider knowledge. Toward the explosions. Great. You got exactly one shot at this Aloy, so spare the sarcasm and make it count. You see that bridge over the ravine? Yep. Memorize its location. There's a rappel point on the side. That'll be your way out. And these Eclipse troopers? Avoid them, or kill them, your choice. The blasting should cover any noise you make. Find the tall neck and destroy the module on top. Here we go. Nice not to be working in the pit tonight. All that grime. When I sleep, I dream of getting it. Is there fighting up ahead? 
No. It's a binding operation. So long as you're quick, it won't affect you. Oh good, another secret. So long as King Itaman languishes at Sunfall, coddled by his mother, he will never learn the true lessons of the sun. I have tried to instruct him, but the shadow of his mother's influence is upon him. I took him to the palace balcony to behold an offering of sacrifice in the ring, but he showed no thirst for it. He averted his gaze. Look to the sun, I told him. Do not shield your eyes. In all things, it is absolute. One day, he nurtures life, and the next, scorches life away. He burns the skin of champions and wretches alike. All right. Never does the sun the show pity. Focus that you see that to lack. is the example of Sun How King of Tornik. The example of your father. But before my instruction could take hold, I'm she across. was there. Won't be much into her robes, burying his face against her breast. Why bother? How is Just King find it and get to the dark when he cannot even destroy see. the module and then get out fast as you can. Sure is a lot of blasting up there. Sounds busy. Busy enough not to notice you, let's hope. I see it. They've built some kind of structure. Climb it. The sooner this is done, the better. This feels wrong. Everything here is raw. Just get to the module and destroy it. I see the module. Good. Now be quick. This. This is Hades. Aloy, this is not the time. It's a metal devil. Open the module's casing, now. Aloy, do as I say or all is lost. Yeah, 
I noticed. Keep running! Uh. More kicks ahead. Bridge in sight. That's the way out. I know. going, but you survived. You knew Hades was there, and you sent me to him? I won't deny I risked your life, but it was the only way. Now, with the focus network down, we can both get what we want. Access to the secrets of Zero Dawn. I'm past trusting you with secrets. Good. That means you're wising up. Trust is for fools. It shifts and crumbles like sand. A poor foundation for any partnership. But mutual self-interest. Now that is a solid bedrock upon which you and I might build a new science of understanding. We both need answers, Aloy. And thanks to you, we're on the verge of grasping them. It's unfold. We'll speak again. You miserable... <laughs> If I could toss this focus and be rid of you, Silence, I would. But we both know I need it. Sunfall it is. 